Hello, my name is Gabriela Robles, and I'm an international student at college. So, as an international student, what I do in my everyday is to wake up early and then start getting ready for my classes. And sometimes my dad can takes me to the bridge. If he can't, I have to take the bus. I cross the bridge walking. Sometimes I'm late, so I have to run. And sometimes I can just cross the bridge very quick because there are not people. But some days there are so many people that I, I miss my bus. I get late to, to my classes. I'm from Juarez. I'm a graduate student from high school, Bachelor 6. Over there, I practiced flag football, which I excel at, at the national level. I also got a very good grades, so that motivated me to study in the U.S. to find more sport opportunities to achieve my dreams. Pues ahorita es un día normal en el que voy a la escuela temprano. Ahorita hace mucho frío y como ven está muy lleno. Avistaba muchísima fila en el puente, ya se me hizo de día allá adentro y pues hay algunos así que se meten, entonces te hacen llegar tarde al bus. Ahorita, por ejemplo, ya no, ya no alcancé el bus. Pues ni modo, voy a tener que esperar hasta el otro. So, as an international student, uh, there are so many things that can happen that can affect my grade. Like I, I say, the, the buses, the, you have to wait for the bus, you have to, to stay on the line. So that's kind of effort for us. Once I'm in, taking my classes, I need to pay attention to my professor uh, because education needs it's important to me to represent where I come from, so that means more effort because my dad and my mom believe in me. De, por ejemplo, mis, mis papás, o sea, tienen esa esperanza de que me va a ir bien y todo eso, entonces eso me carga como responsabilidad and give my best effort, my best studying and everything. So I just need to, to give my best effort, study, and right now I have a, a good GPA, I have a 3.5, and I'm, I'm planning to, to increase it because that's what I, that's what I wanna do, I wanna improve myself. So to be an international student means that you have to give your best. You have to do even more effort than others because with the simple fact that you have to wake up earlier just to, to get on time to your classes. It's just a, a big trip. After my classes, I dedicate the time to go to the gym and do some exercises or to play basketball. I love sports and those are part of my life. So that's why I always, every day, I play some sport. I do some exercise exercises. When I go home, it's, it's very late, it's at night. So when I'm on my way to the bridge, I always call my dad to ask him if he can take me. If not, I need to take the, the bus. Bueno, son las ocho y media de la noche y ya vengo de regreso de la escuela y ahorita mi papá ya está del otro lado del puente esperando. When I go home, I take dinner and I just prepare my stuff for the next day and get to sleep. We came here with a dream to improve ourselves, to give our best of us, and also because we want to get a bachelor's degree or a master's whatever we are pursuing in our education. Ajá, sí está bien. Que representamos de dónde venimos, de dónde somos. The city of El Paso has a lot of international students, so that's why I feel that we are part of El Paso. Thank you.
Only in El Paso is produced by KCOS, El Paso PBS, in collaboration with local filmmakers. Only in El Paso is made possible with support from El Paso Museums and Cultural Affairs Department, working to develop a world-class arts community in El Paso. El Paso Electric, proud to be your local utility. Visit El Paso, raising the profile of El Paso to attract visitors near and far. And PBS Digital Studios, original content that explores science, arts, culture, and beyond.